We're establishing Europe's largest fully integrated battery gigafactory here. The electric vehicle industry faces a significant challenge, creating a battery that ticks all the boxes of high performance, long range, fast charging, affordability, and eco-friendliness. These factors make electric vehicles appealing and competitive while ensuring customer satisfaction. Yet, achieving excellence in all these areas is complex. It demands significant innovation and research. Numerous companies are striving to meet these criteria, and Northvolt, a top EV battery manufacturer, has unveiled its latest battery technology, offering a promising solution. Let's delve into how Northvolt's breakthrough battery could disrupt China's battery dominance. Founded 2016 in Stockholm, Sweden, Northvolt envisions a greener future by producing sustainable, high-quality, cost-effective batteries. The company has pioneered an eco-friendly manufacturing model that minimizes environmental impact and maximizes social benefits. It has also cultivated strong partnerships with major players in the automotive and energy sectors, like BMW, Fluence, Scania, Volvo Cars, and Volkswagen Group who have collectively ordered over $55 billion worth of Northvolt batteries. Currently, the company operates its first gigafactory, Northvolt ETT, in Skellefte, Sweden. This facility is among the world's largest and most advanced battery factories, aiming for an annual capacity of 40 gigawatt hours by 2024. Powered entirely by renewable energy sources like wind and hydro, and employing cutting-edge technology and automation, Northvolt ETT ensures high efficiency and quality. Additionally, the factory recycles materials like lithium, nickel, and cobalt, reducing waste and emissions. It also serves as a hub for innovation and education, fostering collaboration among researchers, engineers, and students. Northvolt ETT isn't just a factory. It's a community dedicated to crafting the finest batteries for a sustainable future. The company also operates a research development and industrialization campus, Northvolt Labs, in Vesteras, Sweden. Northvolt Labs is a center of excellence and cooperation, where the company explores and experiments with new battery technologies and solutions. The campus features a pilot production line, where the company produces small batches of batteries for testing and validation. Northvolt is active in Sweden and other countries where it has expanded its presence and activities. The company has established joint ventures, subsidiaries, and offices in countries such as Germany, Norway, Poland, Portugal, the U.S., and Canada to serve the local markets and customers and to access the best talent and resources. The company has partnered with some leading players in the automotive and energy sectors, such as BMW, Fluence, Scania, Volvo Cars, and Volkswagen Group, who have placed orders worth over $55 billion for Northvolt's batteries. The company aims to become a global leader in the battery industry and contribute to the transition to a low-carbon economy and society. Now, Northvolt has just unveiled a new cutting-edge sodium-ion battery that could revolutionize the field of energy storage systems worldwide. The battery does not use lithium, cobalt, or nickel common materials in most batteries, but are also scarce and expensive, and often associated with environmental and social issues. The battery uses sodium, a more abundant and cheaper material widely available in most regions of the world. The battery also offers a cost-effective and sustainable alternative to conventional chemistries that rely on scarce and expensive materials. The battery has a high energy density and a long cycle life and can be used for various applications such as electric vehicles, grid storage, and backup power. The battery is compatible with existing battery infrastructure and equipment, and can be easily integrated with existing systems. Sodium atoms have one electron in their outermost shell, which can quickly lose or gain to form positive or negative ions. These ions can flow between the battery's electrodes during charging and discharging, generating an electric current. Five years ago, Meng Ali, a Stanford University postdoctoral scholar, said something about the challenges of sodium ion batteries. He said, The layered metal oxides have shown limited cycle stability and air sensitivity, and the polyanion only delivered a moderate energy density. 
mainly because of the bigger size of sodium cations compared to lithium cations. Further research is required to get better sodium host materials with higher energy and better stability. A lot has changed since then. Researchers have made breakthroughs in developing new electrode materials and electrolytes that can enhance the performance and durability of sodium ion batteries. Some of these innovations include Prussian white, a compound of iron, sodium, and cyanide that can accommodate sodium ions in its lattice and achieve high energy density and long cycle life, and sodium glass, a solid state electrolyte that can inhibit dendrite formation and improve safety. These advances have caught the eye of the International Energy Agency, which tracks the progress of clean energy technologies. Laura Cody, Director of Sustainability at the agency, told Energy Monitor, a sister site to Power Technology this month, some clean technologies have moved up the innovation ladder. One example is batteries based on sodium. Until a year ago, it was mostly lithium. Now we know that sodium can play a role. Northvolt's current sodium ion batteries are designed for use in energy storage, as they can balance the fluctuations in supply and demand of renewable energy sources, such as solar and wind. They can also provide backup power in case of blackouts or emergencies. However, the company is improving the energy density of its sodium ion batteries, which is the amount of energy that a battery can store per unit of mass or volume. The company aims to increase the energy density of its sodium ion batteries so that they can eventually be used in electric vehicles, requiring high power and long range. The company plans to be the first to mass produce and commercialize sodium ion batteries and bring them to the global market. The company has already demonstrated the feasibility and potential of its sodium ion battery technology by achieving a remarkable energy density of over 160 watt hours per kilogram at its research and development facility, Northvolt Labs in Sweden. Northvolt sodium ion battery, on the other hand, uses Prussian blue, a pigment first used in the 18th century to make blue paint. Prussian blue has a unique property. It can host sodium ions in its lattice and enable the charge and discharge of the battery. The potential of Prussian blue for batteries was first discovered by John Goodenough, a Nobel Chemistry Prize winner also known as the father of lithium-ion batteries. Northvolt hopes to provide customers the first samples of its sodium-ion battery next year and reach full-scale production by the end of the decade. The company plans to build new factories alongside the four factories. It is currently preparing to produce lithium-ion batteries for vehicles. The company aims to become the first company outside China to have a sodium ion product validated for energy storage and to bring it to the global market. It is quite key to be the first ex-China player to have a sodium ion product validated for energy storage, said Lola Hughes, research manager at battery consultancy Row Motion. However, she also noted that the success of sodium ion batteries would depend on several factors, such as the price of lithium batteries which has fallen in recent months, and the speed of scaling up the new technology. She said that sodium ion batteries would have to compete with lithium ion batteries, which are still the dominant technology in the market, and that they would have to prove their performance and reliability in various applications and conditions. She said that sodium ion batteries have a lot of potential, but also a lot of challenges. Investors are less enthusiastic I see than last year, and some of the future development of the sodium ion supply chain may be delayed or even canceled, she said of the Chinese groups producing sodium ion batteries. The low lithium price has made the cost benefit for sodium ion less evident, she added. This dual advantage of cost effectiveness and enhanced resilience makes sodium ion batteries a compelling and environmentally conscious choice for the future of energy storage solutions. What do you think about this? Let us know in the comments section.